when is the only uh, your site the specific day of death of a person that's mentioned in the Torah turns out that it's only Aaron's uh, your site that's mentioned Moshe usually is considered that he died on the seventh of Adar but even about this there is some dispute and it's not mentioned explicitly it's uh, learned from how much time passed after Moshe's death until the Jewish people entered the land of Israel and then counting back from the tenth of uh, Nisan uh, a month and three days that's how the seventh of Adar as the presumed yard site of Moshe is uh, calculated uh, the sister of theirs Miriam it says in the Torah in uh, Parshat Chukat that she died on the uh, in the mo first month but it doesn't say the date and there's dispute on which day she died but about Aaron we just read the previous Shabbat that he died on the first day of the fifth month which is Rosh Chodesh Av which is today Monday the week of Parshat Dvarim and uh, I think it's not a coincidence that we always learn uh, about the death of Aaron that at the time when the uh, first of all it's read in the Torah uh, right in, on Shabbat before that and secondly it's at the time when we start the nine said said as day of the year the period of the first nine days of the month of Av which culminate with the destruction of the temple Aaron of course was known to be the man of peace and we need peace so much the peace between us when the Jewish people are uh, hating each other and when there is no peace be among us then all the enemies come and destroy us and that's how the second, second temple was destroyed according to our sages because of the enmity between the Jewish people and that's why it's so important when we commemorate the destruction of the temples and we have to fix whatever was destroyed then and we have to remember the Yorzeit of Aaron when Aaron died the Jewish people were uh, uh, eulogizing him and were, uh, were uh, commemorating his uh, death for the following month so it's certainly a good time now to remember what Aaron represented and what we have to do to be better and I hope that today when peace is more important than ever when the Jewish people is, are attacked by so many different countries and so many different uh, enemies of ours some want to destroy us physically some use the power of words to spread all kinds of lies and horrible things about the Jewish people and the state of Israel it's so much more important today especially for us to unite to stop fighting and to understand that we can only survive if we love each other and if we'll stand and then Hashem will help us and we will be able to continue may Hashem haferat satam destroy the council of all our enemies that they won't be able to do anything bad to us in the merit of the great high priest Aaron and his Yom HaShanah as they call it today the Yorzeit in uh, Yiddish is uh, what is called Yom HaShanah by Sephardim, the day of uh, his uh, passing. And please subscribe to our channel.